Welcome to Stan Line. So today we're going to be taking a look at the Christensen Longfish. Um, so this board's kind of a scaled up version of the classic Christensen fish. Um, they've kind of stretched that template out, given it a much longer rail line, uh, set the fins back slightly, and it's just been designed to give you extreme speed and just allow you to draw a really different line um, on like the open face. I think kind of like big carving turns. You can use these boards in bigger waves. They work really well in the small stuff too. Um, it's just a really versatile, um, kind of like long fish template. It's just going to give you something completely unique and something completely different to all the other boards. So looking at the shape of the board, we've got plenty of foam up in the front, making for a great paddle. Um, but you will notice the template is nice and sleek. Um, so they haven't just kind of blown up the small fish, as that would get really chunky. These things have been stretched out. Um, and it is a really nice sleek outline. The rails have been a super low and refined, um, which gives these boards a really nice feeling. So they, it allows them to engage in a steeper face and it allows you to really initiate your turns nice and early, engage that rail um, into the wave and kind of gives you that smooth rail to rail transition as well. Looking at the bottom of the board, um, it's got a nice roll up in the nose here, which gives these boards a really Kind of, they're really easy to initiate your turns and they really want to turn. It gives them that nice smooth um, kind of flowing feeling for your turns. And then you'll notice we've got a really deep concave um, running through the fins there. Um, and that's where kind of all your speed generation is going to come from. It gives you tons of speed, tons of projection down the line. Um, and you can really get these things moving if you kind of put them in the right section, take that nice high line, they'll run down the line with incredible speed. So size wise, um, we've been stocking these boards from 6.8 to 7.6 um, and you can really go for kind of whatever size you, you fancy really. The smaller ones are obviously going to fit into the pocket a little bit better, the bigger ones are going to give you more glide, more speed. Um, with regards to wave range, these boards are super versatile, so they work really well in whatever you want to take them out in. They'll go in kind of waist high mush, they're really forgiving, they glide over all the flat sections, um, but they will hold their own in solid lined up waves as well. Um, so you can, you can take them out on you know, as big a waves as you want to, and they're going to hold a line, they're going to allow you to take a really different approach on the wave, and just be something completely different to your, to your usual boards. Um, fins wise, I recommend riding them um, with with the keel fin, so something like the, the Captain Finco uh, Chris Christensen uh, keel fin template is going to be ideal, or something like a K2 or something like that goes really well in these boards. You want that kind of classic keel fin template, but something with a bit of rake as well. So I'd say these boards are going to suit anyone that's looking for something they can use in a really wide range of conditions, and something that's just going to add um, a completely different feel, give you something completely unique to add to your quiver. Um, if you've got any questions on the board, feel free to drop us a message or pick up the phone, give us a call at the shop anytime.